Dean from Leisure Travel Vans. We're in beautiful Kelowna, British Columbia at a vineyard out here. But I'm very excited because we have a brand new floor plan. 2023 Unity Murphy Bed Lounge. Hard to believe we built the very first Unity MB 14 years ago, and we're very excited because we have the next generation of Murphy Bed. I mean, look at this baby. But if you're looking for a small motorhome, 25 feet, one inch total length, seven feet, 11 inches wide. It has a beautiful slide out. So you're small, you're compact, and yet you can expand out. It has a big bed, it has a big TV, and it has a big bathroom, lots of interior storage, lots of exterior storage. This is the next generation of Unity Murphy bed. Hey, should we start on the inside or the outside? Inside? Come on inside, let's have a look. Welcome inside the 2023 Unity MBLR brand new floor plan, totally redesigned leisure lounge chairs. Absolutely fabulous, look at this. Head back goes back, even more comfortable than ever. Totally redesigned Murphy bed, and we've added a landscape window up at the top here, so now you've got windows on the passenger side and windows on the driver's side, cross-through ventilation. That's one big request we had from our customers. More windows in a Murphy bed, well now you've got it. Reclining seats, both sides, plus both chairs from Mercedes-Benz turn and swivel. We even have seat extensions here for comfortable seating, so you can easily have seating for four people people watch TV watch movie fantastic not a bad seat in the house and look at this beautiful 40 inch pop-up TV and we also have a smart blu-ray player and then up here we have a beautiful sound bar with streaming Bluetooth you can actually watch the TV down low as well and if you want to swivel the TV look at this you can swivel the TV and watch it from the driver passenger seats which is very, very comfortable. You can put your extensions out on the Mercedes Benz. Kind of feels just really relaxed and great to sit here. And look at the size of that TV, it looks fantastic. Or you can keep it in the lock position and you can totally recline even better. Headrest goes back too. Look at this. Is this not the best? Both chairs have USB charging ports and wireless charging as well. And the sound bar is streaming Bluetooth plus all of our connections. If you have a satellite dish, we have a great option called the T4 WineGuard satellite dish. It does dish, direct, and bell. So if you're into satellite TV, boom, goes up on the roof, auto acquisition, and your receiver will plug in right here and a little storage area as well. And you may only be watching TV on a rainy day because if you're in the Okanagan Valley here, I mean, look how beautiful that is. Wow. Sure, look at this flush floor all the way to the cab area. No stepping up or stepping down. Walk directly in and look at this flooring. Brand new flooring. Actually, I had to get on my hands and knees. I actually thought it was ceramic tile. It's actually a tile look linoleum. It's absolutely fantastic, easy to clean. And look at these new leather colors. Three new leather colors. This is Dove. We have sand and clay. We also have three new wood colors. We have white oak. We have rift oak. And because I couldn't say espresso correctly, mocha. Three brand new colors for 2023. Plus we also have our Fenix white uppers in Bianco white, which is optional. Plus we have two solid Corian countertops and Arctica white and concrete. On all Unity motorhomes for 2023, we've gone to new ceiling panels with beautiful LED diffused soft lighting. They're dimmable as well. Ducted air conditioning throughout the entire motorhome, including the bathroom area way back here. It's gonna be nice and cool, I like that. But look how beautiful the ceiling panels are. It looks absolutely fantastic. This is our white oak, absolutely beautiful. From this living room area, now let's make it into a dining room area. This is a multi-functional motorhome. Very easy to do, look at this. Flip this up like this, that's our back support. One cushion slides over like this. This side does the exact same thing. Just gonna flip that up bring this cushion over. I'm going to then bring my table up and out. Look at this, beautiful legless table. 
look at this nice and big look how much room i have for my feet yay now this is a prototype motorhome so we may do some changes when we go into production on things we're also evaluating a few other table designs but just so you know this is currently the prototype table that we have in this model look at the little storage area that we have in here that's really smart use of space work area you know laptop computer breakfast lunch dinner playing cards at night i mean just a great multi-functional area another nice option we have an optional front table right here if somebody was sleeping in bed i wanted to get up early do some work on my laptop or just sit back watch tv if somebody was still sleeping little table here really smart little option to have and now it's time to go to bed look how simple this is going to be to make in a bed only two cushions have to be moved out of the way we're just going to move these two cushions over to here and look at this these slide down very simple headrest stay on and everything and then we have two locks on both sides so you'll release the lock here and here and then we're going to bring this down like this look at this is this not incredible this comes out release our mattress and look at that 20 seconds flat it's a full size nice big bed and it's a look it's a walk around island bed hello gotta go to the bathroom no problem Want to go back to bed? No problem. Want to get a drink? No problem. It's an island bed. That is so fantastic. And look at the size of it. Oh, and it's comfortable. Foam mattress. And you still have easy access to your USB ports on this side and USB ports on this side. If you want to read in bed, look at this. Headrest, built in. I absolutely love it. Built in reading lights nighttime shade for sleeping at night and look the brand new landscape window on the driver's side awning style window so you've got lots of natural light and lots of air ventilation throughout the entire motorhome we have an area right here solid corian countertop that you can put your cpap machine or your sleep apnea machine and we've got an inverted plug to plug it in plus we have two more charging ports right there and our secondary control panel for our multiplexing but at nighttime i'm tired turn off all the lights in the motorhome plus you want to read or you want to watch tv in bed once again look at this how simple it is boom tv up back into bed i go sit back kick back and relax my favorite channel okay nap time's over we have to get some more work done and this is how easy it is to bring the bed back up very very simple once again probably 20 seconds to bring it down and 20 seconds to bring it back up look at that make sure you lock in your uh, supports both sides and look at that we're back into a dining room area you can have the bed down with the slide out in okay this is very cool we have the slide out completely in once again easy to walk from the cab area back into the motorhome get a drink use the washroom right use your dining room table you don't have to put the slide out in the event that you need to sleep with the bed down you're at a walmart you're at a, a truck stop or a place where you can't put out your slide out okay that's fine so we're going to leave the slide out in we're going to put our legs down we're going to unlock our lock both sides and look at this we can bring the bed down very smart this comes across like this and look at this boom bed down slide out in Hey, have a little nap at a roadside stop can't have the slide out out no problem the slide out can be in you can have dinner have the table down you can even have the bed down and when we want lots of room we just press the button out it goes wow this is some serious living space i could do my pilates down here and look up at our beautiful ceiling we have our beautiful opening skylight look at that beautiful blue sky lots of sun if you have a few mosquito problems we can fix that or if it's super hot out like it was today we can have the shade come across and still have some fresh air coming in or i can go half and half or i can leave it all the way open once again easy to close easy to open a new exciting feature on all unity models is the firefly multiplexing system where you can control the entire motorhome right off of the different monitors throughout the motorhome and this is the main control panel this controls the entire motorhome as you can see here you see where your tanks are we know how much propane we have black tank gray tank freshwater tank and it also shows you how much battery life you have in voltage you can also set up the auto gen start off this you can also control all the lights in the motorhome i can turn individual lights off and on i can turn all the lights off and on you can also hold the button to dim them 
You can also turn off all the lights off the master switch. You can turn them all off or turn them all on. You can set your temperature, for example, for your air conditioner, or you can set the temperature for your furnace. That's all controlled right here. So now if you order the propane generator or the diesel generator, you can have auto gen start, set your temperature, plus you can download the app. So you can run it off of your cell. You can turn lights off and on and set your auto gen start, starting your generator, turning off your generator. You can even open and close your fantastic fans. Check your tanks. That's all done simply right off of your smartphone. Nice little feature to have. Standard on all Unity models for 2023. Awning style windows open and close, right? If it's raining outside, you can leave the windows open. Plus we have nighttime shades that block off for privacy and you can put them right in here. We have little clips built into the windows. You can put the shade into this clip and then you can leave the windows open. It's not going to blow out of the way. And above the cab area, we have more storage right here, optional safe. This is our window treatment that goes around the windshield for privacy at night, which is very nice. This just locks in place. See how I push open? So push open, soft close, locks in place, European hidden hinges. More storage in here, a little storage up in here. More storage over on this side. Look at this, nice big deep cabinets. Right here is our Wi-Fi booster. So standard is the WineGuard Wi-Fi booster. It can also do 4G service. You can buy the service from WineGuard or you can get a secondary SIM card. All these are also inverted plugs as well. So that all plugs in right there. It's European hidden hinges, soft close, lock in place. So this 2023 Unity MBL, our prototype model, has the Truma Aventa air conditioner, which has three different speed levels. It has a dehumidifying mode and a night mode. It's very energy efficient and very quiet. Truma Aventa, very excited to try it out on this model. You also like when you come into the motorhome, we got some hooks here for your jacket, all done in ultra leather. This is the brand new Dove color, very nice. Entrance handle with a built-in LED light and all done in ultra leather. So some storage area here, fire extinguisher. I like this, look, place for my shoes when I came in put my shoes out of the way. They're not in the step well. I'm not going to fall out of the motorhome. We have a secondary control panel for our multiplexing. You can control the entire motorhome, turn all the lights off, turn all the lights on, turn on your awning lights outside, your porch lights outside, lights here, lights outside as well. We've also got a 12 volt battery disconnect switch for turning off all your power. And once again, our screen right here, screen door built in brackets there, supports going across so the pets aren't going to go flying through. Privacy right here. Locks in place with a magnet, very nice, pops up. And then up here we have our inside control panel, our optional leveling jacks. These are hydraulic four point leveling jacks, two jacks at the back, two jacks at the front, press a button, boom, boom. Right here we have our optional solar panels. We have 200 watts of solar panels or 400 watts of solar panels. Those are rigid panels and uh, they're very efficient. Right here, we've got our Truma AquaGo Comfort Plus hot water heater control panel here. Eco mode, if you have it on eco mode, it does not keep the hot water hot all the time. If you put it on comfort mode, it keeps the water hot all the time. When you turn on a faucet, boom, you have instant hot water. Over here, we have our 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter. Now, if you order the optional lithium battery, so standard or AGM batteries, two AGM batteries, optional are the lithium batteries, which this model has. When you order that option, we invert the microwave in the kitchen so you can turn on your inverter and you can run the microwave. Or for example, we've been running our TVs and stuff right now off inverted power. So that takes the battery power, switches over to 120 volt power. Here, this on off switch, that is for heating the optional lithium batteries. In cold weather, minus 34 degrees Fahrenheit. Lithium batteries do not want to work efficiently. They start to stop taking a charge and stop giving a charge. So then we would turn on our heater to keep them warm. And this is our switch right here for our slide out when it comes in and out. Always be looking at the slide out when you're bringing the slide out in and out. So that's our inside service center, nice and simple. Look at the size of this galley. Beautiful picture frame window, awning style windows. Once again, nighttime shades built right in. Absolutely fantastic. Look at the storage. I mean, look at the storage. Look how deep this goes. Look, seriously, this whole thing can fit in here, right? Good example, right? That's a big plate, right? Does it fit? Right on. If it doesn't fit, you must have quit, right? And those are the rules. You can have cabinets in motorhomes, but if they don't hold anything, they're not really a cabinet. European hidden hinges, LED lights in the cabinets. 
soft close, lock in place. Look how much room you have in the galley. Look at this right here. I think my mother-in-law can fit in there. Hello! Not quite, but a Keurig coffee maker sure can. What a great place for that right there. Solid Corian. This is Antarctica White. We also do concrete. It's on this prototype MBL, a two burner induction cooktop right there. So nice thing about the induction cooktop is it's not gonna produce a lot of heat into the motorhome. Okay, look at this, our beautiful deep stainless steel sink, chrome faucet. Of course, we've got our Corian sink cover here. And right here, we've got, this is great, we've got a dish drying area right here, built right into the countertop. So that is a new feature, and I actually love that. So you got a place to put your plates and cups to dry. We've got built-in LED lights here. We've also got a beautiful accessory rack, paper towel holder, places here for your spices. Now we still need drawer space, right? So look at this. We do have some storage underneath there. Once again, we've got the special diet going on. And look at that beautiful soft clothes. Look at that cutlery drawer right there. All lock in place. And hey, what is this? Yes, it is a pull-out pantry. How can you go wrong? That is absolutely beautiful. And look at this, a built-in garbage can. Also on this proto model, we have the Truma Vario Heat Propane Furnace. It's right there. And you're gonna see ducting throughout the motorhome. So that's on this prototype model, a new Truma Vario Heat Furnace. It's very efficient using propane and it's very quiet. And right above the galley, we have a beautiful, fantastic fan. We have one here and one in the bathroom. It runs off of our multiplexing system. Just press that button and up it goes. Set your speed. You have three different speed levels there. I mean, it can really move some air in and out of the motorhome. Did you see that? That's live. So here, look at this. Beautiful hanging closet. Not too many small motorhomes have one hanging closet. We have two in this motorhome, one up front. You can have adjustable shelves here. I mean, if you wanna use it as a pantry, you can. We've already got a pantry over here, but you can use it for clothing, hanging your clothes. Absolutely fantastic. Nice drawer here. Look at that soft close again. Another deep drawer. Right here is where we have our breaker box and our fuse box right there. Over here, we've got our convection microwaves. You order the lithium battery option. This is inverted. You can run the microwave off of the inverter, which runs off the batteries. You don't have to start your generator. So you wanna warm something up really early in the morning or cook something, you don't have to start your generator if you're dry camping. Other campers will love you for that. And once again, it's a standard microwave and it's a convection microwave, so you can bake on it. We have our three-way refrigerator, so it runs on 12-volt power, 120-volt power, and propane. We have three different ways to run the fridge. So separate freezer, separate fridges, about 6.7 cubic feet, and you can open it from this side as well. So nice and easy, so we love our three-way Dometic fridge. You're gonna love this brand new low-profile Ultra thin bathroom door. Oh, does that ever slide beautifully? Like that is nice. It's absolutely fantastic. Not too many people invite you into a bathroom in a small motor room. Usually only one person can fit. I think we could have four or five people in here. That's how big this bathroom is. This is a complete residential style dry bathroom. Come on in. Okay, this is one of the big features of our Murphy bed that customers absolutely love. We've made this bathroom on the MBL even better, the big, big stand-up shower. And if it can fit me, it can fit anybody. <laughs> so look at this, about 6'4", six, 6'5", six, to the top, maybe even 6'7". Beautiful skylight. We've got the glass doors. Look at that curved, absolutely fantastic. LED rope lighting inside the bathroom, place here for your towel. And I love this, the shower head, you can take the shower head off. It has a little control button here for water restriction, which is very nice. Put it back in place, hot, cold, running water, place here for your shampoo and soap. But I mean, look how much room you have in here, right? That's my arms all the way out, right? Lots of room this way. I mean, if I close the door, you probably can't see me, but I can turn and spin around. That's how much room I have. That's a big, big shower. We have a window, awning style window in the bathroom. Fantastic. We've got a beautiful privacy shade that covers that up. We have a macerator toilet, right? So you can set that for two different flush levels. It's China, right? 
So China Masturator Toilet. Fantastic fan right over there. Just boom, press the button. Look at that. Boom, it flies up. It's gonna pull all the air out of the bathroom area and it moves some serious air. We also have a multiplexing panel right there so you can turn off all your lights. You can turn on your lights from the bathroom, turn on your fan above, turn on the water pump. Ducted air conditioning in the bathroom. Oh, it's like 35 to 36 degrees Celsius today when we're filming and it is hot. So we've had this air conditioner pumping and it's absolutely fantastic. LED lighting throughout. Once again, nice, soft, diffused lighting. Another big feature here is this beautiful, big redesigned vanity. Look at the room that you have for storage of stuff in this area here. And again, that big mirror here for dressing in the morning. And hey, don't forget about leisure clothing and leisure gear. Check out our store online. Cups, hats, shirts, lots of great stuff. Absolutely fantastic. But I love this vanity. Solid surface, countertop, stainless steel sink, chrome faucet. A little accessory channel here, right, for putting your things in. And look at this, storage underneath. This is unbelievable. Full water filtration on all Unity motorhomes. And if you think that's impressive, look at this. This is impressive for storage. Great place for putting your towels, linens, extra bedding. Look at that. Wow. And over here on this side, a second hanging closet. Two hanging closets. Adjustable shelves, right? So you can adjust the shelves and drawers, pull out drawers. Look how deep this is. Once again, soft close. During the design process over the last year, we actually had our staff at Leisure Travel Vans working on it and using it at a local campground. And we've been gathering feedback so that we could improve it and make it as perfect as possible. And I think we've succeeded. This is seriously exciting. The brand new 2023 Unity Murphy Bed Lounge. Huge, redesigned, fantastic bathroom. And look at the size of this galley. Pull out pantry. We have the beautiful Murphy bed with his almost a king size bed, 68 wide, 76 inches in length this way. You've got the brand new leisure lounge chairs. They all fold right back. Look at that, that is absolutely fantastic. The big, big TV, look at that, pops all the way out. We actually have another surprise for you on the outside. As far as TV goes, I can't wait to show you the outside. You can watch it down low. Look how much room I have. Multiplexing, right? Run it off your phone. We've got the brand new landscape window above there. Lots of light. Skylight up top, 25 feet, one total length. The slide out gives you lots of area. I mean, this is a winner. Let's talk about what powers this motorhome down the highway. Come on into the cockpit area of the Mercedes-Benz 3500 series cutaway chassis. We're in the cab area of the Sprinter 3500 series chassis, 11,000 pound GVWR, 15,250 pound GCWR. I mean, this is one beautiful chassis, but before we start talking about this chassis, can you guys see this view? This is a panoramic view, V6, turbo diesel engine, 188 horsepower, 325 foot-pounds of torque. It rolls down the highway. Electric assisted steering, which is absolutely fantastic. Look at this, I can turn this thing on a dime, one finger, absolutely incredible. All the controls are built right into the dash. I never have to take my eyes off the control panels. But let's talk about a couple other little things. Little sunglass holder here, nice little, we've got map lights, we have storage up in here, sun visors, power windows, power locks. We've got power seats, heated as well, one button press. If you happen to have long legs, look at this. The Mercedes-Benz seat pops open for a longer leg. Guys, and speaking of long legs, I have a 34 inch inseam, right? I have the seat not even all the way back and I can't touch the pads. I have to bring the seat all the way forward like this. You have some lumbar support, it's super comfortable. All one level floor on all Unity Motorhomes for 2023. We have a seven speed automatic transmission that powers this baby down the road. I mean, fuel economy is incredible. We got charging ports, we got a, a wireless charging port right here. We got USB-C charging ports there, built-in cup holders. We got airbags in the seats, airbags in the chassis, airbags in the steering wheel for safety. Safety is very important. We order all of our chassis with lots of safety features that we get from Mercedes-Benz. Front collision impact assist, 
lane keeping assist, side wind turbulence assist as well, which is very important, adaptive cruise control, traffic sign assist. It tells you exactly what the mileage is on all these little side roads and vineyards. Some of these features are subject to change based on availability from Mercedes-Benz. We also have telescopic and tilt steering, so you can be very comfortable when you're driving down the road. The ergonomics of the chassis is incredible. Everything is at my fingertips. You can actually move the transmission up and down by speed so I can downshift and upshift right here, paddle shifting, just like on a sports car, like on a Corvette or a Porsche. Of course, we have power disc brakes all the way around the motorhome. We have six wheels, right? So we have dualies at the back, two in the front, so a total of six wheels, nice and stable going down the road. This is like an iPad right here. So everything I have, I can control the entire motorhome right here. I can set different channels. Sirius Radio is available. It's a subscription service, but that comes with the motorhome as well. Hey, Mercedes. How can I help you? Voice activated navigation system and help service. Absolutely fantastic. I can browse through the different menus. I have Bluetooth. I can actually hook up for Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. All my information on the chassis right here tells me what my fuel consumption is. I can tell what's going on. I can even hit my owner's manuals for information. It tells me where I am for oil changes and DEF refills. So everything is at a touch of my fingers. And we have My LTV. That is one fantastic program. All manuals, product videos. While your motorhome is being built, you can watch all the videos on how everything works in the motorhome. We also have all the interior and exterior dimensions. Plus, you can join different travelers clubs as well. We have travelers clubs that have rallies all over the place. Our photo contest that we do every year, which turns into our yearly calendars. We have some great prizes for that. All my LTV members have live chat access to our service advisors. Courtesy of Leisure Travel Vans, we give two years of roadside assistance on every leisure travel van when they're first purchased. You can renew that service later on. It gives you roadside assistance, gives you a lockout service, fuel service, gives you concierge service. So make sure that you use our roadside assistance program. The next generation of Unity. Wait till I show the outside. Hard to believe it has been 14 years since we started building Unity Motorhomes, the brand new Unity MBL. Let's start off with our beautiful power awning with wind sensor. Look at this simple, press the button here and out the power awning comes. It has a built-in wind sensor as well. Always make sure you have your wind sensor on. So the awning is gonna come out about seven feet. And it's gonna be about 12 feet in length. But look, it's a beautiful sunny day in Kelowna. Look at that view of the lake. Come on, this is where you should be. But now I've got lots of nice shade. Absolutely great. Just chill back and relax with the lawn chairs. Wind sensor, look at this. So if the wind blows, got the wind sensor on. Look at that, woo! Big gust of wind that automatically goes up. I also love the built-in LED lights right there. That's nice at nighttime. We also have lights here, which you can turn on off of your phone with our new multiplexing system, or you can turn them on right here inside the motorhome as well. So we have lots of outside lighting, LED lighting built into the handle for getting in and out of the motorhome, LED lights, LED lights. If you're in a really uh, tight jam, you can see that the mirrors go in and out. They're power electric heated mirrors, right? Built in step for getting in fiberglass. Look at this. This is our transition molded fiberglass, fully insulated ties the chassis into the motorhome gives us that beautiful unmistakable unity look when you're driving down the highway so small motorhomes tend to have no storage we have storage look at this storage here and storage here pop open look at that lots of storage galvanized sheet metal right that way it won't crack beautiful strong and look at this we spray foam all the tanks and all the undercarriage areas here when you're driving down the road, you're not gonna damage anything. And here's where we store our 30 amp shore power cable, electrical cable. Struts built in, it's not gonna hit you on the back of the head. And look how beautiful this door. Fiberglass curve, look how it locks in place. EPDM rubber hinge seal, once again, locks in place. We have our own leisure travel van key for our compartments. And we can lock the doors, seal them up. Look at that, nice little locking key there. And on this side, we also have our standard 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter. iPads and all of our electronics need clean power. So when you turn on your inverter, you wanna make sure that you got a pure sine wave inverter so you have clean power. It's not gonna damage any of your electronics. Look at this, I love this door. Absolutely locks in place, beautiful. Great option 
All of our customers are gonna love this. Look at this, outside TV. Now this is one great option. 40 inch smart TV with a built-in Bluetooth sound bar, so you can watch your favorite movies. And this is one of mine, this is Dune. A lot of people do like that movie. Nighttime movie, tailgating party, why not? And look at all these beautiful LED lights. LED lights built into the awning, LED light here, one for your handle for getting in and out of the motorhome. Absolutely fantastic. Or you wanna have the family movie outside in front of the fire, why not? Two struts to hold the door up, not gonna hit you on the head. Beautiful, optional 40 inch TV with a Bluetooth sound bar. So if you don't order this option, more exterior storage. Above our optional TV compartment, we've got our beautiful, sexy, frameless glass windows, awning style, means they come out. If it's pouring rain outside, you can have the windows open so you can have ventilation into the motorhome. We have windows now on both sides of the living room area. It's gonna give you natural light and cross ventilation. We have our entrance door. Now, another nice option is the keyless entry remote that works off the Mercedes-Benz key fob, so I can lock the doors or I can unlock the doors right off of the Mercedes-Benz key fob. And I've got the electric power step. I can have, right now we have it on travel mode. I can quickly turn the switch and now it's on camping mode so it doesn't go up and down every time I open the door. That's a great little feature to have. Not gonna wear out the motor on the step. And you're gonna absolutely love our beautiful screen door, how it locks in place. We have built-in braces throughout the door, so if you have pets, they're not gonna come flying through the screen. Standard on all Unity motorhomes are AGM batteries. Optional are lithium batteries. So if you order the optional lithium batteries, you have 200 amp hours. We also have heat pads built into all of our lithium battery options. Look at this beautiful curved wall this is a unity motorhome full fiberglass roof up top fiberglass flex roof steel frame floor so walls roof and floor are all vacuum bonded vacuum bonding makes them super super strong strength insulation and quiet when driving down the road. Three important factors. All Unity motorhomes come standard with full body paint each color painted three times paint 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 second color paint 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 two coats of clear, right? And we have eight different exterior colors for 2023. This is shadow. We have white suede, silver, graphite, glacier, champagne, Eurosport, and everybody's favorite, Atlantic blue. Eight different exterior colors. There's no deckling that's gonna fade over time. You can wax it and bring the shine back up. I love the beautiful molded fiberglass fender skirt and down below here, of course, we've got dual wheels on the back. You don't want a motorhome that doesn't have dual wheels, right? Because we're way more stable going down the road. Four wheels at the back, two at the front. That's a total of six. They're a 16 inch wheel. And this is the nice option. These are Alcoa aluminum rim. They have the Durabrite finish. They also allow you to check the inner and outer tire pressure on the uh, wheels, the inner wheels and the outer wheels. So it's a nice little option to have. Standard are steel rims with simulators. This is the option, Alcoa aluminum rims. Underneath here, you can see this maybe, we spray foam all the wheel wells underneath. So once again, no damage into the motorhome and it makes it quieter when you're going down the road. We also have a great option, auto leveling jacks, hydraulic auto leveling jacks, four point leveling jacks, one button press, boom, levels the coach. You're gonna absolutely love that option. First time in a Murphy bed, we have an opening bathroom window. How exciting is that? Some, some natural light, awning style window. You can leave it open if it's pouring rain outside. We work our way down right here here we have our optional generator. So this one has the optional 3.6 Onan propane generator. We also have a 3.2 diesel generator. With the generator, you are self-contained. So right now we're at a beautiful vineyard. You know what, I'm just gonna stay here overnight. I can turn on my air conditioner, I can run my generator. I can go anywhere I want and dry camp. Generator, very important to have. And some more exterior storage. How great is that? Once again, EPDM rubber hinge sealed, fiberglass, built-in strut, galvanized sheet metal. And if you look underneath here, we spray foam all of our tanks underneath, fresh water tank, gray tank, black tank, so that stones can't damage it. Also gives a little bit of insulation. And right here is our standard propane quick connect for your RVQ. This works well with our optional exterior table. I always call this our briefcase or our suitcase optional table. It's all made of aluminum, it's powder coated, it has adjustable legs, it's so very simple to set up. Look at that, right there and there. We have the built-in anchors built right into the motorhome. 
Boom, there we go. We can adjust the table down or up. We also have a beautiful 120 volt outside plug if you have an outside electric range you want to put on here once again you can hook up your rbq off of our propane quick connect sit back and relax you can have dinner outside you can cook outside and here's what's best don't go anywhere look at this put that on you know so i can now have lake view lunch supper and dinner all in the shade we're at the back of the motorhome so molded fiberglass rear mask insulated look how beautiful the contour of the design built-in backup camera runs off of our 10 inch monitor up front on the mercedes-benz led lights another option that you can get is an optional rear ladder we go with a two-piece rear ladder so nobody can get up on your roof without the second piece of the ladder which stores in this outside storage compartment this is a two-piece bumper so we have a bumper here and the main mast so if somebody were to back into something you can still replace just the bumper which is kind of nice down here we've got our 5,000 pound receiver hitch seven pin connector and make sure you always check your owner's manuals for how much you can tow with the motorhome so the GCWR on this motorhome is 11,000 pounds the GVWR is 15,250 so if you were to load the motorhome up to full maximum GVWR of 11,030 pounds that would leave you 4,220 pounds of towing but you must make sure that you weigh your motorhome full Fully loaded to know exactly how much you can tow. The rear mask on the Unity is absolutely beautiful. You can see a Unity coming down the highway from the front or from the back. Absolutely spectacular. Okay, in the event that I've had way too much wine, this is where I get to sleep. This is the doghouse. This is incredible. At least two golf bags in there. Got our place for our optional ladder. Storage space in here, LED light. It's like all carpeted in line, but that is one big exterior storage. Wow. Here's our outside service center. You're gonna love this service center because everything is basically in one place. So this motorhome has the optional macerator pump for dumping your tanks. Everything is already connected. It can actually pump uphill. You can pump into a smaller sewer drain, which I have at my place, so I don't have to go to a three inch dump service station if I'm in traveling. Simply turn it on, right? Pull the black tank valve first, let it pump all out. You'll hear a different noise in the motor. Once you hear that noise, then you pull the gray tank valve right here and that kind of cleans the hose out. You can also use the exterior shower for cleaning the hose as well, which is kind of convenient. So that's a nice little option to have. Even if you order the optional macerator pump, we always include the three inch dump hose for dumping your tanks. Here's our fill for our propane. So we have 15 gallons of propane. You have a propane service place, fill that up right there. Right here is our black water flush so if i want to clean my tank my black water tank once again i would hook up the hose into a sewer area i would pull the black valve hook up my garden hose and then pour water into it and that would clean your black tank so that's all right here so we have a great option up on the roof we have the t4 wine guard satellite dish that does dish direct and bell if you have a portable satellite dish you would plug it in here and you could watch tv inside the motorhome don't forget we have a new optional tv on this motorhome as well on the outside park has cable you just plug in the cable you can watch tv right here is our propane disconnect switch so when you're filling up the propane you would turn that off some ferries in long tunnels you have to turn that off as well right here is our water pump switch so if you forgot to turn the water on inside the motorhome and you're dry camping and you're going to run the water out of your main water tank you would turn that on and i could then use my outside shower it's just got a quick connect here pull this in lock it in place and i've got hot and cold water for outside if uh, you happen to like to fish you can clean your fish outside you can clean your pets paws uh, i have a new boxer dog his name is rambo i would clean his feet here which is kind of cute and it just unlocks like that right here is our water fill for filling up our fresh water tank or if you want to be on shore water you just turn it over there and here's where you fill up your fresh water just pop this open here bring the hose up boom close that up and now nobody can tamper with your fresh water. This is for winterization or for filling up your fresh water tank. So let's say you run out of fresh water and you wanna put fresh water into your tank, get a big jug of water. You can then turn on your water pump and suck it up into the fresh water. But mostly it's used for winterization. For those of us that live in the north in the cold weather, we wanna winterize our motorhome. We're gonna get some RV antifreeze and we're gonna suck it up and run it through the lines. That way our lines don't freeze. Works with our winterizing bypass valve which we press right there this is also cool we also supply this little tool here for draining your fresh water tank and this way you can dump your fresh water tank at the end of the year 
Super convenient, everything is located in one place. Quick and easy for setting up for camp and breaking down camp. On this 2023 Unity MBL prototype, we have the Truma Vario Heat Furnace. It's ultra quiet, ultra efficient, it's propane powered. Three different modes, low, medium, and high. It's ducted throughout the entire motorhome and it's very quiet when it's running. And here is our Truma AquaGo Comfort Plus hot water heater standard on all Unity motorhomes. We have two settings on it. We have Eco and Comfort. When it's on Eco, it doesn't heat this little tank here, so it would take time for the hot water to get heated. If you put it on Comfort, it will heat this one liter of hot water. As you use that one liter of hot water, you've got instant hot water. As it's using this, the heat exchangers are getting hot, and then you have continuous, unlimited hot water. Truma AquaGo Comfort Plus hot water heater. One fabulous hot water heater and it's on all Unity models. Right above here we've got another beautiful galley window right here. Once again awning style. You can have cross ventilation, lots of natural light in the Unity MBL for 2023. Right here we've got our shore power connection, 30 amp right there. The dual wheels, once again all insulated. Fender skirt. Let's look at this, two more storage bins. Once again, all line, the struts, right, the curve. And we also store our sewer hose here, even if you order the macerator pump, the optional macerator pump, that stores right there. But look how deep these storage bins are. Lots of exterior storage. So make sure they're locked in place before you put your slide out out. You don't want to scratch the paint. Okay, with a press of a button from inside the motorhome, here comes our slide out. Slide out is worm gear operated. We run two tracks, top, bottom, both sides of the motorhome. It's an 18 inch slide out, landscape, awning style window up top, more natural light, more ventilation inside the motorhome. Nobody builds a slide out like we build a slide out. Steel frame floor, vacuum bonded, aluminum framed walls and roof. We go with dual tracks, top and bottom on both sides. So the slide out always goes out nice and square, fully insulated, super strong curved as well, a sweeper seal and two bulb seals. Bulb seal here, bulb seal here, squeezes together nice and tight. We also include the slide topper awning that prevents any bird droppings or debris from going into your motorhome. Also prevents rain from going in as well. And you can see when it closes up tight, seals back into the main body of the motorhome. You can't even tell you have a slide out. Plus you can leave the Murphy bed down with the slide out in and still use the bed. If you're at a little campground area or a rest stop and they don't allow slide outs out, Walmart, you can still go to sleep at night. You can see our transition molding here, fully insulated. Once again, the transition into the chassis looks spectacular. Right here, we got a place here to fill up our diesel fuel right there. And I like this, so no fumes get in the motorhome. Boom, close it, lock it. Nobody can tamper with your diesel fuel. And look, nice little light right here for getting in and out, courtesy light. Once again, you can move the mirrors in if you're in a really tight spot, you need a little more space. Once again, power heated, Alcoa aluminum rim option. No big overhang like a traditional class C, right? Panoramic view. I mean, there's the panoramic view. You want to be seeing that when you're rolling down the road all the time. Beautiful aerodynamic. This is all molded fiberglass, insulated, right? Ties into our fiberglass flex roof up on the roof. And up on that roof, we've got a 15,000 BTU air conditioner. We have a Wi-Fi booster. We have optional 200 watt or 400 watt rigid solar panels. Everything up on the roof is completely sealed. Is this not absolutely Beautiful. Let's talk about what powers the Unity Motorhome down the open roads, and that's the Mercedes-Benz 3500 Series Sprinter Cutaway Chassis V6 Engine, 188 horsepower, the chrome grille, LED lights. Look at this, easy access for cleaning your windshield. So we order all of our Mercedes-Benz Sprinter chassis with every option that we could possibly get. So we've got side wind assist. So we have the wet wiper with rain sensors built in as well. High beam assist. We've got front collision impact assist, traffic sign assist, built in fog lights as well. The adaptive cruise control, lane keeping assist, electric heated power seats, 10.25 inch monitor up front. Some of these features are subject to change based on availability from Mercedes-Benz. If you're looking for a small motor home that has big bed, 
big bathroom, big TVs, optional two TVs, one on the outside. This is the motorhome for you. Small, compact, you can take it anywhere. So this model that we're showing you right now is one of our prototype models. So we're trying out a whole bunch of different things in the motorhome. Some things will make it into production units and some won't. We really appreciate everybody that supports our company since 1965, 14th year of the Unity MB. So make sure you go and see your local leisure travel van dealer and see one of these in person. And the very exciting thing today is you can go to our build and price on our Leisure Travel Van website and you can price out a Unity MBL with all the options and colors that you want. This should be you driving one of these. Hey, Dean from Leisure Travel Vans, I'm gonna go do some wine tasting. Yes, let's do that.